uh, what I said was uh, the biggest challenge for gaming. Yeah, and so we talked about the first one. What's the second one? So well, the, the, the first one was designed, second one was technical. Technical. Oh, okay. I should have clarified that, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah I probably should have. Um, so there's two big challenges. I don't know which one's bigger. There's understanding gameplay design, mm -hmm. um, so you can make your character immersive and responsive, and then there's understanding the technical. A lot of times, when an animator first gets into the industry, he thinks it's, it's going to be that clip that he makes in Maya. But that clip is completely out of context, right? So you've got this gray background, and you've got your character performing an action, and it's hard to imagine him being responsive and in this gameplay environment. Mm -hmm. Like, one of the biggest things that an animator will do in film is they'll anticipate to the right and then go to the left. You're pressing on the left stick. If your character goes to the right and then to the left, it's going to be like, oh, wait, 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 no, no, I was pressing left, you know? And there's that, that disconnect. How do you merge all these clips together, and how do you combine them for this end result. So really you're talking about procedural animation and understanding how procedural animation works in engine. Is procedural animation is a good way to put it. We're even layering now, so like yeah. you could actually put a lean forward, you could put uh, an arms pump, and you could put like a, a lean to the left or to the right, and all these little components combine to form your run front. So even a run front now isn't really just one animation, it's yeah. a combination of pieces. Let's say you got a character holding a gun, like how is he going to run and, and aim his gun without this arm popping, and you've got to craft all the ways he could aim. You know, in a first person game like Halo, you know, you've got this first person camera and your left and your right sticks. That character can do almost anything and you've got to respond to all those stick inputs, so it's a combination of so much data. Yeah.